Hi, I'm Shreya and this is Decoding Code. In this video, we'll talk about hardware and software and how they can work together to accomplish a goal. Hardware is all of the physical stuff that you can touch. For example, your monitor, the keyboard, and these little tiny processing chips inside of your computer. Also, the mouse and the wires are considered hardware. Software is all of the code and the programs that run inside of your computer. Some software programs are TikTok, Snapchat, and Instagram. Do these two communicate with each other? Yes, these two communicate with each other. They need each other. Without hardware, software is just a bunch of gibberish that no one really has a use for. And without software, hardware is just a junk piece of metal. So they do need each other. But how do they communicate with each other? To answer this question, we first need to go over the CPU. The CPU is the central processing unit. This is like the chip that controls all the other chips. It's like a king chip. And it is like the brain of your computer. It follows the instructions that you give it. And instructions are written in binary, which is just a bunch of zeros and ones. Binary code is the most simple form of software. Up until the 1980s, people were actually writing in binary. And so they had to write out thousands of zeros and ones just to do a simple command. But now the code is more closer to English. So it's easier to use and overall just way better. Software tells the CPU what to do, but how does the CPU know how to multitask and do multiple things at once? Well, your answer is the operating system. The operating system is like the gate master. No system or program can go through it without going through the operating system. And the operating system processes all the instructions that the CPU has to do. So if you're multitasking and multiple things are running at once in your computer, that's actually not what's happening. The operating system is what's going through everything and switching from one program to another in a speed that we cannot see, like pew, 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 except I cannot say that as fast as the actual process. Are computers smart? Well, all they do is do what we tell them to do. So we are the smart ones and the computers only do what we tell them to do. So the smart people are the people who make amazing code and make amazing operating systems and even the people who make amazing hardware like this chip. We are the smart ones, not the computer. In my next video, I'll talk about the basics of software. So make sure you go on over there when I upload. Like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell if you guys want to be notified when my other videos upload and if you like this video. Comment down below any questions that you guys might have and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.